Come on down. So the Biden administration is sending more agents to El Paso, Texas, over concerns about the recent migrant surge there. This, as a Trump-era policy called Title 42, is set to expire a week from today. You have been on the ground in El Paso. What are you seeing there? It's literally hell on earth. There's a great deal of concern about what is going to happen next week uh, if Title 42 is officially lifted. Uh, right now, over the last few days, what we have seen is uh, about an average of 2,500 migrants crossing the border into the El Paso area. Uh, we had to, to fix something that was broken, especially by the the last administration. This is separate from the issue of Title 42. Uh, and what we are hearing from officials here in El Paso is that uh, shelters are over capacity. Uh, the uh, processing centers with uh, Border Patrol are also over capacity as well. Uh, we're certainly uh, doing a lot more to secure the border. So that is raising a great deal of concern about what is going to happen next week. And city officials here are sounding the alarm. The border, the border is secure. The border, um, we are working to make the border more secure. And, and Don, the Biden administration is predicting that uh, when, if Title 42 is lifted, there could be as many as nine to 14,000 people crossing the uh, U.S. southern border uh, next week. That is what they are preparing for. You're confident this border is secure? We have a secure border. You're lying. What are we doing? This is the United States of America, damn it. What are we doing?